Welcome back to more Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. Um, I'm hoping to get two parts of progress done before I go back to Brink. Gotcha. Also, last time my game crashed. Oh crap! There can't really. Big buildings and give away all. All their money just to watch someone flip paper squares on a table. For as long as I remember, the dead horses have thought that places of the old world were taboo. Oh, there was a. Look so shotgun in there last time. It respawns random equipment each time, and the game crashed last time, so. There was useful stuff in there. There was actually useful stuff here. And hang on, we got a. What have we got? We got the 8 ball. Aw, oh, this 8 ball's not special. Yeah, in one of the games, it actually boosted your luck. Having an eight ball with you. Come on, it's in here somewhere. Eight ball. There we go. Actually, I kind of want to see if I can play pool. Okay, let's not give uh, let's not give Void something to try. Cause he will sit here for twenty minutes trying to play pool while you people watch him suffer. So, I think that might be all the story progress we get done this time, is just getting that. We might get a little more done. It depends how quickly I get to the next area. Or if I find enough, you know, random stuff to keep me occupied and entertained. Let's go get the north one. Feels good to be doing some actual scouting, not just following. He's basically complimenting us for using his perk. Shooting at. Oh, but it's not such boosts our maximum health, it looks like. Uh, we need something to heal us, but not quite that. Fresh potato and healing powder. Jumping down. Oh, 
Yeah, that qualifies a blood sausage. And a banana. No. Ah, oh, snap. Okay, this is getting me nowhere. His mantis gauntlet was poisoned earlier. But enough about that, we have somewhere to go. We also have stuff to heal. Thin red paste will heal us 210 health. Sunset sarsaparilla. Let's have a calm, refreshing sunset sarsaparilla. Apparently we're in combat. I see no combat, so I'm just gonna keep walking. Keep finding stuff. Called Caterpillar's Mound. Am I gonna find evil caterpillars up here? There's something over there. Rather than being a normal person and running away from the evil thing. Let's head straight first into it. What exactly did you have on you? Yeah, we're almost leveled up again, just from killing random things pretty much, and two small quests. Dude, he had a shish kebab and a pair of tomahawks and a fire axe. Yeah, I'm just picking up random weapons at this point. Fire axe throwing weapon, I'm betting. Oh, it's a. Dude, I like. I mean, it's a fire axe, man. How can you not like it? 
We don't have a pair of shish kebabs, so we can repair our first one. Tomahawks are throwing weapons, though. Or at least they should be. If he had two of them, it would make sense. Okay, we found something to test this out on. Ah, I can't pick it back up. Fine. Okay, we need a new weapon equipped. Uh, yeah, we'll make some story progress, I guess. Well, that's that thing. Teddy bears, Nuka Cola, drugs, toy cars, teddy bears. Way I heard it, salt upon wounds butchered everyone in New Canaan, and nailed their corpses to the cliffs. How do you people get these ridiculous names? I mean, they. I know it's just that they seem ridiculous to me, but still. Okay, there. There's another lunchbox in here. There we go. Those are the lunchboxes. No, but there was something further along that trail. We might go check that out before this part is done. I mean, at this rate, we're going to level up before this part is done. Which I personally have no problems with. Yeah, I say we go check out what this is. And then we can fast travel back. Once I'm completely and utterly hopelessly lost. Oh, Rad Scorpion! Okay, I'm doing... I did nothing in that fight. Gotcha. You got nothing. Actually, you got the Rat Scorpion. But, uh, we are, yeah, 1000 EXP away from leveling up. Uh, 
Ah, I want in there. Ah, park ranger hat. Combat knife. There can't really be a place where people go into big buildings. We could walk down there, or I could fast travel. I choose the option that lets me abuse the teleport system of this game. Why? Because I don't need to get that perk yet. There's a perk for breaking your limbs enough times. I don't know what it does. Honestly, I'm not in a big hurry to find out. I'm close as it is. I know we will get it before the game. Whoa! I here. Yeah, I forget what we're looking for in here. I'll take that though. Some bobby pins and. Wait, why did I just pick up a cup? Let's put the cup back. Yeah, I'm just gonna try and continuously try. We have enough lockpicks that it's worth it. This medical supply kit is mostly intact, but several of the serial bandages have been broken open. Okay, so we need to find duct tape and turpentine for that one. The other medical kit is... Hang on, there's duct tape over here. So where is some turpentine? Ah, I want my and see our money back. Okay. It says it's right here. I'm betting it's on the other side of the wall, isn't it? Why do you carry all those bottle caps anyway? They jangle like crazy. There we go, turpentine. Yay. We are still missing 300 and something EXP points. Yes, I know EXP points redundant. I don't care. Looks like we might not level up. We'll be close. Next time, when we get back from finishing off Brink, we will definitely level up at this rate. Enemies? What enemies? Give me like one little thing over here we have to kill.
Okay. Mm so now we have to go north. Uh, if this part goes to 20, or, th or not 20, if this part goes to 30 minutes, I don't mind. So we're just going to keep going until we get to Daniel. Okay, pretty much until we level up and reach Daniel, we are going to keep going. Both objectives must be complete before we finish. The Narrows up ahead. That's the Sorrows territory. They're peaceful enough, but you don't want to make them mad. No, of course not. We don't want to make them angry. It's not like I could, you know, butcher them all. Oh, wait. Yes, yes, I could. Couldn't die. You are the one Joshua Graham sent to us. Blessings of the Father in the cave on you. Daniel is waiting for you. I like your Blair bear glove. Where can I get one? A Soros Yaogwai fist is a sacred symbol. It shows that we belong to the tribe and have willingly undertaken a dangerous quest to aid the tribe. Each Soro makes his own. And only after hunting and slaying a Yaogwai that threatened our people our shaman, White Bird, oversees the rites. Perhaps if you spoke to him, he would allow you to undertake such a quest. Mm. That's all I wanted to know for now. Then I will look forward to our next speaking. Yeah, I think we need to go up. This is where being on a computer is so much easier. You can just tilt the key, TCL, walk straight up. Well, in oblivion, anyways. I love it. Caesar's Legion has 35 tribes, and it handles the NCR. This is two tribes, and they got their own side quest. Uh, I think I've just trapped myself effectively. Jump off! Love being able to sidestep. I am a master of the art of walking off cliff and coming out of it unscathed. both in video games and the real world. So he's the one we have to talk to if we wish. Daniel. Yo, hey, he's got a cool beard. The dead horse has told me details about the attack on your caravan. A stranger's sympathy might not count for much, but for what it's worth, I'm sorry. The Sorrows will mourn your friends, too. They mourn everyone, even the White Legs. They have sensitive souls. Innocent, if there is such a thing. In spite of what's happened, I hope that Joshua and I can help you out of here. But to be frank, we need your help, too. Joshua told me you needed a few things. I think this is everything. Well, I'll be. I was starting to lose hope we'd be able to get any of this, much less all of it. Tribals are smart, but, well, they're ignorant. <sighs> Letting go of a taboo is difficult for them, so I knew it would have to be one of us. Turns out all it took was a gentile, or, uh, no offense. These supplies are a godsend. But if we're going to evacuate Zion without drawing more white leg attention, I need you to go back into the valley. Specifically? I need you to scout out some locations for White Legs and try to recover a map of Grand Staircase, a wilderness area to the east. There's also the matter of the roads. We're going to be heading out of the east side of the park, but I'm not sure the way is clear. So we just leveled up, now I need to get... 
Anything to help. I'll do what I can. I appreciate the enthusiasm. There aren't a lot of people in the wasteland with kindness to spare for anyone who isn't kin. Since you've been poking around the valley, you might see more activity from the White Lakes. One of the Sorrow's hunters, Waking Cloud, has volunteered to help guide you through the valley. She has a special talent for staying out of sight. After this, it's just a matter of getting everyone out of here safe and sound. And hopefully, you can head back to the Mojave without any more trouble. Daniel is giving you some pre-war mining explosives and a special detonator for them. They aren't useful as weapons, but could be used to collapse certain caves if that proves necessary in your exploration. Falls Chalk has been returned to the Dead Horse's camp. We've lost his companion perk. So yeah, science to 50. I'm thinking I want to boost my unarmed skill 10 points. And then we'll start working on lockpick. I just want to see what all well, everything we have is. Could take some of this. Something or other. Um, I might at a later point. I almost definitely will at a later point. Actually, no, we're going to take one now rather than taking one at level 28. We'll take one now. I'm thinking Nerd Ridge. Maybe not. Oh, where is it? You know what? Yeah. We want sneering imperialist, perhaps. No. This is the biggest problem with me is deciding what perks to get. No, you know what? we're gonna go back and take the points I'm thinking of. Intense training. We need to boost our endurance to eight. So we're gonna do that for levels twenty two and twenty four. So hang on, let's go back. Big Bird. Big Bird, come talk to us. You shall be known as Big Bird. That's not a bad pistol, actually. Why do I have so many weapons? Oh, right, because I'll use them at some point. Hola, outsider. Welcome, child of omens. You come to receive visions of truth? I, what? I don't know what visions of truth means. Take drugs, kill a bear, seek medicine plant, return with sacred datura root, receive visions of truth, they guide you. Wait a minute, what if I don't want to do any of that? Okay then, I guess I'll just go then. Go. Return, maybe yes. Return, maybe no. But go. <laughs> Take drugs, kill bear. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we already killed five Yagwais, at least. And as for the sacred Datura, well, we've already got two. Hit the music. He only says that, I'm betting. The take drugs, kill bear. Takes drugs, kill a bear. If you have the wild wasteland perk. But yeah, that was something you don't get to see every day unless you 
play this game, this portion of the game, every day, in which case you do. Uh, with that being said, though, oh, come on. Actually, it's going to autosave for us. So, with that being said, I'm Plasmavoid, and I'll see you next time.